Hello, everyone. 125 billion. That is the estimated amount of funds that are being lost by merchants in the credit card space due to friendly fraud chargebacks. So what is a friendly fraud chargeback? Due to the simple dis click on a dispute this charge button on their credit card portal, consumers can easily make an invalid claim and get their money back on a transaction that they made. This can range from a simple mistake, like misidentifying the merchant's name on their credit card statement, or something more criminal, like trying to get a travel package for free. So who foots the bill when this happens? The travel merchant. The funds are taken automatically from the merchant's account, and the, the goods and services have already been provided, so they are also lost. And this is a growing problem in the travel space. For example, we recently sponsored a survey in the travel space that showed that 36% of British consumers that were surveyed had recently, in the past 12 months, submitted a travel-related chargeback. During my time in the payment space, I saw firsthand the amount of funds that were being lost by these merchants. However, there is a process in place for the merchants to recover these funds. They can provide documentation and prove that these are invalid claims. Due to the fact that it takes a lot of time and effort and the fluctuations of chargebacks can make it hard for a manual team to actually present documentation, as well as the fact that there is many rules and regulations around how to present your documentation and Visa and MasterCard do change these rules on a yearly basis, it can be quite challenging for merchants to actually submit evidence. What we've seen is many merchants leave much of this money on the table. Myself, building a solution in this space in a manual process, I experienced firsthand these challenges. I was able to, re to recover millions of dollars due to fighting these chargebacks and began to think bigger. A technology solution was needed to solve the problems of chargebacks. And that is why we built Just. Just is a scalable technology that automates the process of representing chargebacks on behalf of merchants. We build the evidence in an automated fashion. And on top of that, we use a data-driven approach to optimize the recovery revenue of the funds. So how do we actually do that? We're integrated with the major payment service providers that the merchants work with, AD and Stripe, and many others. So we're able to pull the, the chargeback information directly from them. We also work with many third-party solutions that enrich that data and tell us more about the actual transaction that occurred, and we pull several data points from the merchant. Then our system builds a scalable solution that's tailored to that specific merchant's needs, reason code types of chargebacks that they're receiving, end user flow and industry, and we automatically submit the evidence on behalf of the merchants for their chargebacks so we can handle all of the cases at the same quality. But we don't stop there. We use a data-driven approach once we start receiving results, and what we're doing is actually running A-B tests behind the scenes, finding why certain areas are being lost, and improving the recovery rates for our merchants. The more chargebacks that run through our system, the smarter the system becomes. And that's what really makes Just different. We're hands-free, automated, and data-driven. Here's a great example of a merchant that works with us today. We were able to nearly triple their recovery revenues, and to date, we've already saved them over $2 million. And we haven't stopped there. We're continuing to innovate as a company. Just this year, we released our customer hub that allows merchants to see the chargebacks and their statuses across different payment service providers and different card schemes. This is actually something that was not seen by merchants due to the complexity of understanding that between different payment service providers. And today, we're releasing our new features in our customer hub that are data-driven and help merchants improve their businesses. First, we have win rate predictability. Due to the fact that it takes 120 days to receive a re result on a chargebacks, Finance teams have problems understanding 
what their actual revenue recovery will be. So we use advanced algorithms to actually estimate the future recovery rates. Performance explainability. We see that when analyzing the, the fluctuation of chargeback recovery rates is done properly, we can actually provide merchants with insights to improve their business. So we automatically do these analysis, analyses and provide them with an easy to use platform to see them. And finally, our data point value indicator. Merchants who provide us with more data get, receive a better solution from us, but this can be a pain point for them to provide this data. So we provide them with an easy to use feature that allows them to do a cost benefit analysis to understand if it's worth their while to actually invest in providing us more data. Now we're not only dealing with chargebacks on the back end and using machine learning to improve the solution for our merchants. We're using machine learning on the front end to, for merchants to actually learn more about their chargebacks and have more information to improve their business. These features are part of a larger goal for just to become the category king of chargeback mitigation. Thank you. Thank you, Renan. Focus group, let's see your thumbs. You can take a seat. Looks like all greens. Well done, Renan. Morgan, you are sideways, so not completely yeah. sold. <clears throat> How can you automate automatize that? You know, really, because it reminds me of like airline delays. Like you, you seem like you send an email, then immediately you, you say you receive money back. It sounds a bit, a bit more complex than that, no? Right? Can you really automate that? Charge Anyone else want to comment? Yeah, I'll say chargebacks aren't really an issue in in, in corporate travel for us. But I recently um, put an order in for an item, uh, not travel related, and I didn't get it in the week and a half I was supposed to get it, so I thought it was a scam, so I did a chargeback, and two weeks later, I actually got the item. And so I think that there is a lot of opportunity in the whole space of chargebacks, not just in ensuring proper chargebacks, but also making sure the rest of your operation is aware of what has been charged back so that you don't continue to fulfill services that people have done a chargeback on. So I think there's a lot of opportunity, not an area I know a lot about, but. I absolutely agree here. I think the AI, AI element is an, is an interesting feature, especially because it's, it's challenging for hotels, for agencies to just defend and, uh, or basically fight the charge back due to the short timelines and the complexity of mm -hmm. the, the information that it provides. So a good feature, I like it. Anyone else? Yeah, yeah. The, I love this space, sounds super interesting. Love to hear more about the competitive landscape and uh, yeah, super curious about your traction. Looks like you guys are doing great, so love to hear about it. Thank you. Let's talk about automation first. So maybe explain a little bit about that process to kind of address Morgan's uh, sure, concern. Sure, no problem. So really the, the, the process is pulling as much data as possible from many sources. Uh, when we see, once we have that data, we actually have built a foundation of how to build the best solution for a merchant, and we can automate that entire process. It could be uh, proof of delivery, it can be proof of usage, it can be the proof that it's actually the cardholder that actually made the transaction, connecting them to their email, phone, billing address, and many other things. That entire process can be automated, and we've, we're already at a point as a company that we've built the methodology manually, we built automation on top of that methodology, and the automation has proven itself to actually provide better results than the manual process. And in the long term, chargebacks are just growing, so we can't keep it a manual process in the long term. Great. Thanks, Ronan.